In their final game, before facing arch-rivals DLSU Green Archers, the Ateneo de Manila University Blue Eagles scored another dominant victory, demolishing the upstart University of Santo Tomas Growling Tigers, 85-53, Saturday afternoon at the Filoil Flying V Center. And it was Ivorian student-athlete Angelo Kaoam who led Ateneo's demolition team, going 8-for-9 from the field for 20 points alongside with 14 rebounds and 5 blocks. But it was not just Kaoam who had a hand in the victory, as all but one of the Blue Eagles field had scored in the contest. It was a very good effort for our team, said Ateneo assistant coach Sandy Aris Bakachaga. It's really important for our bigs to step up with Rafi Verano out, added Eris Pakachaga, as Verano had sprained his right ankle during Atinio's win over UE last Wednesday. Chu Daves and William Navarro had big shoes to fill. Of course, Isaac Go and Angelo Cowan did their roles as well. They were able to get rebounds against an aggressive US team. Go had 8 points and 11 rebounds as well. The Blue Eagles did not let up in the wire to wire win, stepping on the pedal right from tip off. At the half, Ateneo led by 19 points, one point higher than US's total output. With the pressure defense US is known for, it was important for our guards to break it. S.J. Blangel and Tyler Teo stepped up as well, beamed Aris Bakichaga, as the duo combined for 11 points and had just one turnover. Ateneo would lead by as much as 36 points in the game, 84-48, with 34 seconds remaining. Heading into next week's rivalry game, Ateneo will sport a 4-1 record. The Blue Eagles also pushed the Growling Tigers down to 1-3. Besides dropping us to a logjam with the op fighting Maroons and the new Bulldogs, Ateneo also dealt Aldeneo his worst loss in his four-year coaching career. Prior to this, it was a 71-83 loss to the Blue Eagles when he was still in La Salle back in November 5, 2016. This is also the lowest scoring output for an AO mentored squad. Renzo Subido was the high point man for us with 19 points, but he needed 21 attempts to reach it. CJ Cancino held his own, adding 15 points and 10 rebounds. Atenio will have a week long break before facing arch rivals De La Salle University Green Archers on Saturday, October 6, at the SM Mall of Asia Arena. On Wednesday, AO will face a familiar squad as US takes on the DLSU Green Archers at the SM Mall of Asia Arena. The scores. Admu 85, Kaum 20, Ravina 11, Go 8, Asischo 8, Belangel 7, Nieto Mi 6, Nieto Ma 5, Daves 4, Tio 4, Wong 3, Andrade 3, Navarro 2, Black 2, Mamayak 2, Mendoza 0. Ust 53, Subido 19, Cancino 15, Akomo 9, Huang 6, Li 2, Mahine 2, Casejo 0, Marcos 0, Zamora 0, Battler 0, Laguman 0, Agustin 0. Quarter scores, 19-10, 37-18, 61-35, 85-53.